And that's enough of theory for today. Now, here's the fun part. I am going to let you guys create your own different experiments based on what you have learned so far. But this assignment will count towards your final grade in chemistry. But still, try to have fun, okay? And don't burn the classroom down. After all, safety is our number one priority. So, go to the back of the class, get your lab coats and apparatus. <laughs> Trev? Good job. Experiments. What if the biggest blow up and I burn myself? <sighs> what is it now, Trev? Uh, initially, my mom said that I'm allergic to uh, phenophylline, uh, thermophylline, uh, chrysophylline, uh, th 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 trampoline, you know, all these kind of chemicals. I don't think I should be participating in this. I'm, I'm just gonna see it out. <laughs> you know what's funny, Trev? I also happen to be allergic to students who give bad excuses. So just help me out here and do your work, okay? Shouldn't you wait for it to cool down first? Or wear some glove at least? It's not that hot. See? Ow, 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 ow. Now you try. Anyone hungry? I'll have some. And how would you like your eggs done? Fertilized. Okay, all plants require 17 essential elements for growth. If I can include a few more elements outside of the essentials, I might be able to reverse the decomposition process. Hey, um, I need that. Thank you. Hey, you want to work together or something? I can't figure out what to do with this Bunsen burner other than burning things. You know they'll always help you, right? But I can't break my train of thought right now. Why don't you get started on your experiment first and you can show me when you're done? <sighs> well, I guess I could figure something out. I'm sure you'll do something great. Now back to my phytopathology study. Help! After what you did the last time, you're still trying to burn things down? Don't you remember? You got banned on the Bunsen burner. Then what am I going to do for the rest of the class? Something not related to fire, okay? Maybe like a liquid base experiment or something. Pretty sure you can burn anything with that. Fine. Liquid base. So, Mary, what experiment are you going to be doing? Hmm, I don't know. I'm still thinking about it. Science is not really my thing. Alright then. How about you just answer this? <laughs> oh, okay then. Uh, 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 okay, maybe I don't ask Denise. I'll just ask um, uh, uh, Trev! <laughs> Never mind, I'll just ask you now. <laughs> <laughs> hey, so what are you making? I have created this crystal. Why did you make that in such a short time? Well, it did come with this box. Ah, ah yes, ah, makes sense. Anyway, it's still pretty impressive, right? I'm going to show it to Denise. Hey, Denise, check this out. Miss Shelley, I'm done. I've successfully separated oxygen from ribonucleic acid, making deoxyribonucleic acid. Well, that's fast, Denise. Well done. But that's not all, Miss Shelley. I have also created this special liquid formula, and it can make dead plants come back to life. Wow, Denise, this is groundbreaking. But I'm still not finished, Miss Shelley. This is an age reversal serum. Here, I'll show you how it works. Uh, um, maybe, uh... Mr. Dan, come here! Yes, what do you want? So, basically, one of my students is doing an experiment and I'd love to have you to help out. Ah, alright. Always happy to have the kids. <laughs> Here you go, Mr. Dan.
Ini saya papaya. Then it will only last a couple of hours. Ah! Well, Denise, that was very impressive, but also scary at the same time. I'm gonna continue working on it, and I'll perfect the formula. Uh, okay. So, how's your experiment coming? Nothing. 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 Yeah, I'm still, I'm still thinking about it. You know, I'm, 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 I'm pretty. You say I'll come up with something great, right? I'm sure, I'm sure I'll come up with something great. I think I gotta come up with something better. Yeah. Yes. Take the box. Nicole, I'm pretty sure that fluid shouldn't be touching our skin. It might not be safe. Concentrated sulfuric acid could be really harmful to our skin. Well, let me ask you a question. Is any part of your body burning? No. Then it's fine. Oh damn it, my thermometer broke. Can you help me check if this is hot enough? How? Using your hand. What? Now tell me, were you the one who ruined my painting in art class? No! No! no it wasn't me! Just tell me the truth! Uh, okay! It was me! It was me! But I didn't mean it! That's all I wanted to hear. Go get another thermometer, please. This is quite impressive, Ray Xiang. Thanks. What are you making? Making? No, no, no. What I am doing is a multi tier distillation process involving the selective boiling of dihydrogen monoxide in an Erlenmeyer flask. And once the volatile liquid has been completely converted into a gaseous phase through an endothermic bond breaking reaction, the vapor pressure should be sufficient to provide the activation energy for the subsequent devaporization of the gas back to the liquid phase, which I will collect here in this petri dish as the distillate of the reaction. Isn't dihydrogen monoxide just water? Oh, as I would like to call it, H2O. <laughs> I got H2O too. Cheers. Kevin, H2O2 is poisonous. Kevin, what do you say about drinking your chemicals? Okay, okay. Jeez. Ah, hey, Mary. That looks cool. Can I see? Sorry, Maddie. It's okay, Vincent. I think you should just sit down and not touch anything. No, no, no. It's my fault. Let me do it, okay? Let me help you out. Whoops. It's okay, Vincent. I think you should just sit down and not touch anything. Probably a good idea. Ah. Anyone smell bacon? Oh my god, Vincent, your hair's on fire. <laughs> Listen! Stop, drop and roll! Stop, drop and roll! Don't worry, I got you, man! Oh! Oh! What? It's not my fault. I thought it was water. Debbie, can I borrow your tongs? Julene. I'm trying to focus and I think you really shouldn't ask these kind of things in public. I mean, it's quite unsanitary to share that. I'll wash it when I'm done? Mm, fine. Why are you working on anyway? I'm done. And what's that supposed to be? It's called Luminol. It glows in the dark and it sounds like Harry Potter, but it's real. But it's not glowing though. Well, we have to turn off the lights first. Okay. It's still not glowing. I guess I don't think I can make things glow. Maybe I should try something else instead. Hey Debbie, look at my family plant. His name is Plantric and he has been with us for years. I brought him here today because Denise said that she has been working on some serum that can make him stronger. Are you still ignoring me? It was cute last week but it's starting to affect me now. I can't concentrate. Look, if it's about two girls, I was just messing around, okay? I didn't mean to hurt your feelings. I won't be embarrassed about talking to you anymore. Do you want to sit together during lunch? 
So typical of guys. Yeah, they only start being sweet when they realise they'll lose us. Come on Debbie, don't ignore me anymore, okay? Ben, instead of worrying about me, why don't you worry about Plan Trick? Plan Trick? What happened to Plan Trick? Plan Trick? No! I'm so sorry. I forgot to tell you that you're only supposed to use a few drops. Ah, this should be pretty simple. Let me just balance these two. Hmm. Ah, too little. Mm, ah, nah. Not about right. Hmm. Ah, no. Too little. Oh, ah, a little too much. Hmm. No. Is this too much? Yeah, it's too much. Nah. It's, hmm. This should be okay. Damn it! It's still not balanced. Yeah, seems about right. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Needs a bit more. <laughs> seems about right. Yeah. Maybe this one a bit more. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> yeah, more, more. I think it's time to mix them up together. <laughs> Kevin, you're only supposed to have five milliliters of sodium dial sulfate. Any more, and something can go very wrong. Come on, what's a little difference gonna make? <laughs> Plus, it's faster. Look. <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure smoke is supposed to come out of that thing? Come on, it's just a little smoke. It's not gonna hurt anyone. So, are you impressed? Well, I'm impressed nothing blew up yet. I'll take that as a yes. <laughs> hmm, is that easy? Did anyone see my eyebrows? Hakim, why haven't you started on your experiment? What, what, what are you talking about, Miss Shirley? I'm almost done. Okay, then let me have a look. Where did it go? Good job, Cheryl. Everything's looking good. Don't forget to write observations, okay? Observations? Mm -hmm. Oh, I'll get started then. Miss Shirley, I'm done with my observations. Great! So why don't you share it with the whole class? Uh, I mean, okay, if you insist. So, based on what I've seen, Trev still wants to get back with Abby, but he's doing a really bad job at it, and Debbie is refusing to talk to Ben, which, you know, I don't think she really likes him anymore. Crazy, right? But then, Denise chose Tien Hao over Vincent, like, finally. But it's not all that bad because he has Maddie now. But again, I think he's really conflicted about it. So, I'm not really sure where this is going, but my hypothesis is... Okay, Cheryl, you're supposed to be taking notes on a chemistry experiment your classmates. But they have good chemistry. And like, I haven't been here for a while, so it'll be nice to catch up on them. Then what about your experiment? Yeah, the water is wet. Vicky, that doesn't look like a chemistry setup to me. <laughs> Ouch! What, what's that for? You wanted Abby back, right? Make her drink this. Huh? Are you sure this is safe? What's even in this? You see, 
okay. Thank you, I guess. Uh, 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 Abby, are you, are you thirsty? I am. Thanks, Ref. Working with all that dihydrogen monoxide really makes me thirsty. You mean water? What are you staring at? Are you okay, Wei Xiang? Why wouldn't I be? <laughs> Pishi, where are my glasses, Pishi? Cheer, cheer, cheer. Get this out of my face. Why would I need that? Pishi, Pishi, Pishi. Stop an apology. Are you okay, Wei Xiang? Should, should I call the doctor? I cannot go back to normal. I just want you to know that. I just no, want you to what? know that. No, Why is everybody staring at me? Did I wet my pants again? It's just water, trust me, it's just water. Hi, Beishi. Forget it. What was in that drink, by the way? That was just vegetable juice. Then why is he acting like that? Placebo effect. Wow, Maddie, that's amazing! I saw this on YouTube! How'd you do it? It's nothing special. It's just a little bit of dishwashing liquid, and then an oxidizing agent like hydrogen peroxide, and reducing agent like potassium iodide, and I added a little bit of food colouring to make it colourful. <sighs> Maddie, not only are you good at art, you're also good at science! <laughs> Can I touch it? Why are so boring? So wet. Ugh. Why did you do what Maddie did? She created a masterpiece! Oh yeah, that does look kind of fun. Yeah, what she use? Some liquid and some potato -zum something something. Uh, you mean potassium metal? Ah, potato, potato, potassium metal. <laughs> uh, I guess I could do that. I'll take this. Ow. That's not supposed to happen. Did you just add potassium metal into water? Yeah, just like what Maddie did. But I don't see any foam coming up. Maddie added potassium iodide, not potassium metal. Well then, lucky for me, I only put a little bit. I believe you're looking for this. Alright. Thanks, Larry. Hey, chill out! I found more potassium metal! Wait, no! So using that equation, we will be able to find the angle for x. So, you know the cool thing about erasers? It erases stuff. Cool, right? Jianhao and Mary, is your conversation more important than what I am teaching? You know what? Swap seats with Denise. <sighs> Sorry, I guess you gotta go. Not you, Mary. You, Jianhao! Move it! Now before I move on, does anyone have questions with regards to this topic? I got a question, Madam Sudbang. Yes, Vincent. 
Can I go to the bathroom? Is it can I go to the toilet or may I go to the toilet? Shall I? Will I? Do I? Am I? Go to the bathroom, Minasume? Just hold it in for a while longer. Recess is in 10 minutes. I'll try. I'm not going to go through this anymore. So if anyone has any questions on this topic, ask now. <coughs> what? 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 That wasn't me! Oh yeah, that, that one was me. I pissed in my mouth! Ah. Ah. I, I pissed in my it's mouth! It's not that bad! It's not that bad! Just go to the toilet, Vincent. Everyone get an early recess. <laughs> oh, come on, come on! Oh man, this is as bad, this is bad, this is bad! Gonna go, gonna go! Uh, hey, where are you going? Bathroom's right here. Oh, you're a lifesaver. Thanks a lot, man. <laughs> oh. oh, made it just in time. You guys hear about the seniors going on the cruise? Yeah, apparently Vincent and Denise are official now. But I ship Denise and Jen how? Why gotta be Vincent? But Vincent's not bad. He's a funny guy. But Denise and Jenhao look so cute together. And Jenhao is always misunderstood. Maybe we should do Denise a favour and help them get back together. No! What was that? Oh god. It's happening. Well, right. Thank you. What made you think it was a good idea to use the girl's toilet? It's not my fault, she don't let me in there! That's enough! I haven't been here for years and you become perverts? Oh, no, 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 it wasn't my intention. I, I was just trying to clean the toilets, you know? Yeah. Clean the toilets. Very well. Since you're offering, why don't both of you go and clean all the toilets in the school? Like all of them? All the toilets. You mean all, all five, five floors? And... Make sure by the time you're done, the toilet is sparkly clean. I want to see my own reflection. Oh man, you can see it on the mirror. Hey, you're done for today. Let's go. What? Why is the toilet so dirty? Ew! I'm not gonna use the toilet in this state. Wow! I've never seen a toilet look this clean. What did you do? Simple. I practiced the four easy toilet practices. First, by flushing the toilet fully, wiping the toilet seats clean, binning the litter properly, and lastly, keeping the toilet floor dry. And also, it's important to have personal responsibility to keep the toilet clean. For everyone's comfort. Good. But I think you polished the floors a bit too much. Oh, sorry. I think it's not dry over there yet. You think? The one day I thought I could enjoy and relax, and now it's ruined. Uh, 
Hey, what's wrong with you? Why did you go take away? Can't be that bad. So, how's things with you and Vincent? It's going well, I guess. What about you and Chen Hao? Are you guys like dating now? No. I mean, yes. Yes, we are. That's not what he told me though. Maybe he just didn't want to hurt your feelings. Why would that hurt my feelings? He can do whatever he wants. I know you still have feelings for him. And how he feels about you. I don't think I could ever change that. Oh my god. I'm sorry for interrupting, but I just can't help to hear your stories. But since you're all sharing, I just needed to get something out of my chest. So I've been dating this guy named Robin for a year now, and it feels like I'm slowly losing him. It's almost like I'm not attractive enough, and I just don't know if it's something that I've done. I just can't figure it out. Actually, did you wash your hands? What did Maddie mean by that? What do you mean? Debbie? Is that you? Yeah, are you doing work in the toilet again? Yeah, I was planning to, but... Actually, I think I need help with last week's homework. Do you mind helping me? Of course. Wait, are you guys going through last week's homework? Who is that? It's me, Ashley. Ashley? Are you still part of class T1, T5? Well, not really. I'm in class M4, T1 now. But it's always good to be one step ahead. I guess you are right. Alright, let's go through the questions together. Question 1. This one is quite straightforward. What is the difference between warm-blooded and cold-blooded animals? I know, I know. Cold-blooded animals like to live in the cold. Oh, oh, and warm-blooded animals like to live in the warm. Right? No. Mm. Oh, stuck again? Yeah. It happens all the time. You really gotta do something about the wonky doors. Yeah. Oh. Thank you, Debbie. No problem. I just hope we don't get stuck again. Are they all occupied? It's okay. I can wait. I mean, how long will it take, right? I can't hold it in any longer! Sunny? Sorry. I was just finishing up some assignments. What? So you're not even using the toilet? Yeah. And I'm pretty sure the other two cubicles are empty as well. What? This is empty? Then that must be empty too! What? Juhi? What? This spot has the best reception in the whole school. There's nobody uses the bathroom for its intended purposes anymore! <sighs> you! I wonder who's gonna be inside!
What's wrong with the students in this school? Do you not understand the point of a public bathroom? It is our responsibility to keep it clean as it contributes to good public health and hygiene. And to teach you that, go clean the girls' bathroom. What's wrong? All of them! Go! <laughs> Hello, hello, hello! Welcome! What brings you here? What brings me here? I want to use the toilet! Nah, uh You're here to visit... Robin's Emporium! <laughs> Come on in! Don't be shy! Have a look! I think I'll give it a pass. I'm going upstairs to use the bathroom. Good luck! Wait, 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 I've got coupons! Now these are buy one, get one, only for 5pm. Yeah. I need new pens. I'll tell my only friend. I got five coupons! And I have one friend, okay? Oh no, that's sad. Hi sir, how was your nap? Was it great? Yeah. <laughs> here's your coffee and here's your towel. Thank you! Don't forget to wash your hands. Has the toilet always been this dirty? I can't believe we have so little time to clean it. Hey, are you gonna help? I've already done my part. Done your part? All you did was flush the urinal that you were using! Hey, hey, hey. You got us into this mess in the first place for being a sore loser. Sore about what? About me being with the girl of your dreams. Face it, I win, you lose. This has nothing to do with Denise. Leave her out of it. Yeah, it does. It has everything to do with Denise. I know how you still feel about her. That's why you won't make anything official with Maddie. Cause you think you still have a chance with Denise, don't you? <laughs> don't stop! You know where that's been? <laughs> oh, that's gross. No, no! Stop it, the both of you! You ain't here the whole time? Anyway, you guys are ruining your friendship over a girl? Two girls. Oh, well, fine, two girls. You're gonna be in big trouble if Mr. Rutraja comes here. And we only have one day to clean all this mess up. So, if we can't make it on time, you're gonna ruin Secret Santa and we have to do Christmas without the both of you. No one's thinking about Secret Santa, Kevin. Yeah, it's like in a month. It's so long. Where's Secret Santa? Calm down, everyone. Calm down. You were here the whole time as well? Hmm? I got just the thing to help everyone. How are you gonna help? With a song! How, How is the song gonna help? Gonna help? Hey, man. Hey, man. I'm convinced like you're gonna try sing the toilet clean up! Doesn't even make sense! Class T125, assemble! Yes! Um, just the boys, just the boys. <laughs> Ready, set! It's a must. A clean toilet starts with us. Please don't leave a stain on the toilet seat. Keep it cool, keep it clean, just keep it neat. When you wash your hands, the floor's gotta stay dry. Why? It just gotta stay dry. Oh now you see, it's up to you and me, cause it's our personal responsibility. So remember, let's be better, everybody keep the toilet clean.
Wow, very impressive. It is very clean. I can't believe this toilet was clean by just the two of you. Yep, just the both of us. Just, just the, the two, two of us. us. Yeah, just both two of us. No one else cleaning the toilet. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, who put them there? Did you know they were there? No, I, I had no idea. Who are these I had no guys? idea they were there. Yeah. I see what's going on here. And since there's so many of you cleaning this toilet, I think it's time you guys start on cleaning the teacher's one. <laughs> this is all your fault. My fault? What I do? Uh, you keep it together, say, guys. Yeah. Keep it together. It's for you and... Okay, class, so make a full use of your time in the library. Do some research on assignment, find a book to read. I don't know, learn some new stuff, okay? I'll be there marking your homework. So, I know you guys have a maths class after this, but I'll be cancelling it so that you guys have more time in the library, okay? Hey, did we always have a library? I don't know, man. I just want to see Mrs. June. Crap, Mrs. June is the hottest. <laughs> Wait, Mrs. June like Trev's mom? Yeah. <laughs> okay, students, let me go through some of the library rules with you, okay? I, I like books, Mrs. June. That's great, Vincent. There's a lot of books here. Yeah, she noticed me. <laughs> Mrs. June, let me take it from here. Okay, guys, listen up. You're my library, my territory, and my temple of books. So, before we all start having fun, let's all go through some library etiquettes and follow my rules together, okay? Rule number one, respect the books. Treat them with love and do not throw them aside. Do not bend, do not fold, and do not tear the books. Books have emotions too, okay? How would you feel if someone uses you and throws you aside? Rule number two, no filming, no photography and no videography. Rule number three, no running around in the library. Rule number four, no eating and drinking in the library. Rule number five, read and talk quietly. Quietly! What? Why is there a reserve sign in the library? Sorry, Mel, you can't sit here. This table is only for students IQ level of above 200. We'll give you a chance, though. If you can answer this question, maybe you can sit with us. Who is the author of Lord of the Rings? J.K. Rowling? <laughs> <laughs> it's J.R.R. Tolkien. <laughs> Whatever not. Excuse me, nerds. Move. Gotta get the good lighting. Okay, Jasmine. Who is the author of Lord of the Rings? J.R.R. Tolkien. He's also the author for other class high fantasy novels like The Hobbit and The Silmarillion. Then, what is the value? The value of pi. Oh, please, that's so predictable. It's 3.141.159265359. Anything else? But you don't even study. I don't study because I don't have to study. Come on, Charlie, take the photo for me. Julian, your music is a little too loud. Julian! Shh! We are in the library! I'm trying to read. Can you lower down your volume? It's so inconsiderate. Um. This one's a bit too thick. A bit too thin. This is just nice! Yes! Ooh. <sighs> Oh my gosh, guys, let's be high and sick. Okay. No one's gonna find me here. Yeah. Ah, uh, books are so boring. Hey, what you reading? Oh, Seven Forms of Lightsaber Combat. Seriously? Hey, don't judge a cover by its book, Nick. Anyway, look what I've got. Bamboo tea! 
Did you get one for me too? Ah, 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 look what we've got here. What did I say about no food in the library? Looks like I have to give you a ticket and ban you from the library. Really? Yeah. Out you go. More like kick you out you go. I'll just throw it away. Hey, hey, are you challenging my authority? Or should I send you to the principal's office? Okay, okay, fine, I'll leave. And leave this here? What's happening? Are you joking? Don't joking, don't worry. I know the only one over. Uh, literally, it's not my thing, it is. Uh, uh, he was talking about the balls. The, the balls. Yeah. Okay. Don't worry. I got your back. Hey, Trev. Let's see here. Bro, the AC, it's so hot. Yeah, the weather is so hot, man. Gosh. Oh. Uh, uh, uh. No sweating inside the library. If you're just here for the AC, then you better get out. The library is not just for aircon. Got it? Don't worry, Kevin. I'll sort out my guys. Ah, thanks, Mr. Dan. Ah, nice spot, man. Move over. But we're here first, Mr. Dan. <laughs> Are you the teacher? Or am I the teacher? Who has the bigger power here, huh? Hey! I, I said, said keep it down. down! Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. Sorry. Hey guys, does any of you have a jacket? It's really cold. Oh, sure, I guess it's pretty cold in the library sometimes. Hey, 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 don't worry about that, ladies. I got this. <laughs> You can take this back. I'm not that cold anymore. What? Why? Is it because I don't have abbies? You know, abs, abbies, ab. <laughs> I don't have abs. <laughs> huh? I don't have abs anymore. <laughs> Denise. You like Star Wars too? Yeah, I grew up watching the movies and now I just want to read all the books. Maybe we could read together. Stop right, Hal. I too like Star Wars. And I am the chosen one. We'll see about that, Vincent. Guys, stop, 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 stop. You stop as well. What is wrong with you guys? All I want to do is have a normal conversation. That's right. I'll take that. Thank you, Denise. And you too. Hey guys, what about Harry Potter? Denise, do you want to read with me? Harry Potter? I love Harry Potter. Can you don't touch my wand if you want? Oh. Oh, hey, Mrs. Jun. Uh, I was just wondering, where are the books on hypnosis? Oh, Terry, who are you trying to hypnotize? Uh, um, no, no one. <laughs> I'm just joking. Why don't you try using one of our library guide station? Maybe you can show me instead. Hey, young man, eyes up here. But sure, I'll help you. Don't worry, Mrs. Jun. I got this. Thanks, Kevin. Come, follow me. Hey, eyes up here, young man. Let's go. I love the smell of new books. Hey Denise, what are you reading? It looks interesting. Can we swap? Not too bad. Thanks. Hey Jasmine, what's that you're reading? Can I borrow it? I'm not done with it yet. Well, let me tell you the ending. The boy kisses the girl, and the girl dies because she's too tired from fighting her grandfather. So the guy sacrifices himself and saves her. The end. Can I borrow it now? Fine. Thank you. That's nice. I'm done.
Hey, Willing Sam. Are you going to read all these books? Because you know you can only borrow three at a time, right? <laughs> I'm just going to watch TikTok videos. TikTok? What's that? You wouldn't get it. Oh, okay. I'll go find a book about it then. Okay. <clears throat> there are too many people here, Abby. You know, do you want to go to the corner and read? <laughs> okay, you lead the way. You lead the way. Blood drips slowly from her fists and her body. Ah! Oh, oh my god, what's that? Abby, I told you we should have come here. Sarah, is it you? Have you been here all along? Yeah, I've been living in the library for the past few years. What happened to you? It all happened that one fateful day when I decided to skip class. So I came to the library. I found a nice book. Then I sat down in a corner and I fell asleep. But when I woke up, it was dark and I couldn't find my way out. And ever since that day, I haven't left the depths of the library. Oh my god, that's such a scary story, Abby. Let's not come here again. <laughs> Mommy, you know about this? This is too scary to be in the library. <laughs> hey Denise, are you sure you can read that fast? I've been practicing speed reading. It's actually a really useful skill and it's going to come in so handy for my exams. I think I have a useful skill too. Uh, do you mind if I try something on you? Try what? Like... Look at this pendulum, right? Okay. Now slowly close your eyes. You will now do what I say and slowly open them. Lean forward and kiss me. Ha! Exposed! That's right, Terry. Why are you trying to make Denise kiss you? I wasn't. Yeah, you were. Okay, how are you going to get away with it this time? Huh? We clearly saw you try to hypnotize Denise. Denise, tell them it's not true. Yeah, guys, it's not true. I was just telling Terry more about speed reading. What? Speed reading? What? See? Come on. Let's go, Denise. How does he always do that? Did you get a video? Of course. Great. Let's expose this Terry guy. Once and for all. <laughs> Too much? Too much. Too much. Yeah. Alright, send me the video, Jess. Uh-uh-uh-uh. Do you think I was gonna give you the video just like that? You gotta earn it. Come on, boys. You've got work to do. universe again. <sighs> Dr. Burke! Come on! Close this! Hey guys, it is the 10th year anniversary of this channel. Some of you guys have actually known me for 10 years. How crazy is that? Check it out guys. I joined in September 12, 2010. That is 10 years. 1 billion views. That is crazy. Today, we'll be reacting to some of the videos throughout my 10 year journey and let's get to it. Let's react to my very first video. The first ever video is called How to Cut the Line. September 16, 2010. I have not watched this video since, since I made it. A lot of my friends would know that I don't like watching my previous videos. So um, this is a little hard for me. <laughs> I'm a little bit cringy, so I can't handle watching myself. Okay, let's get to it. Bang, bang, bang. So that was the logo that we made and we actually used Microsoft Paint. The fact that I even mentioned Microsoft Paint shows how old I am now. Feels like time just passed so fast. And by the way guys, you, you see this logo here? Let me show you something. So my parents-in-law made this for me. So the reason this channel was made was because 
myself and two other friends. Um, we were seniors at that time in our high school back in Vietnam and we wanted to make hacks and some you know tips and tricks for our juniors to learn. So we usually cut the lunch line and that is why we made how to cut the line. <laughs> this was in our school canteen. Oh, look at that. Look at that overexposed sunlight at the back. This was really our first video, okay? Chair here, and there's one curtain that isn't unfolded while the other one is. Oh my god. We're super OCD about these things. We take about like, I don't know, sometimes it can take an hour to just set up our set. But now, looking at this, wow, we've come so far. Mm, how to cut the line. Windows Movie Maker, remember? Oh my god, that's me! Ah! Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh, that's all going! Oh, hey, man. Oh, hey, oh, man. What's up, my son? My well, son. I'm freaking pissed right now because my school lunch line is like freaking long and I never get to eat my lunch. <laughs> ah! Oh, son, son. Son, that's son. We'll cut the line tomorrow. <laughs> we will cut the line yeah, tomorrow. We know, cut wow. it every day. <laughs> Oh son, I will teach you how to cut the line with style. Oh, you see? We even had a prelude to our videos, you know? How to cut the line wasn't just how to cut the line. You needed a story and a reason why um, we were gonna cut the line. So if you guys notice, in our sketches these days, we still have a prelude or we have an introduction before we begin the video. So I feel like things haven't changed that much. We still have the essence of um, our very first video, which is nice to see. Ah, oh, our school canteen. <laughs> we have that lady typing in the back. I don't know what's the deal with that. <laughs> yes. Oh, okay. Ask a hot girl to help. Typical teenagers. I, I, I don't know what, what the deal is with this. Our line suddenly went from the canteen to the foyer. Maybe we got kicked out of the canteen. I don't, I don't know what the deal is. Yeah, this guy, Parut, he's one of my closest friends. And even now, 10 years later, um, we're still really close. To me, he's really like family. Do you mind if I stand next to you? <laughs> Do you mind if I stand next to you? Uh, she has successfully cut the line. Be my guest. So this is how you cut the line. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, look at that story. He teaches me how to cut the line and then I cut his line. <laughs> wow. This channel was actually started by three people, Hong Ang, myself and Tuneng. But when we graduated, I sort of took over the channel because Tuneng was really smart and he went to Oxford University. Hong Ang went to study in Germany, so I was left alone to be the YouTuber. And I never really knew where this channel would go, but I guess 10 years later, I'm still making videos. Staring Mandy. Just Mandy? No one else? Wow, <laughs> we only credited the girl. And for our 10 year anniversary, I will be recreating my very first video, remaking my first ever video. Promise you it will be much better. All right guys, so moving on, I will be watching the first ever student video we did. Hey bro, do you have highlighter? No, Oh my gosh, look at how skinny Ridwan was. It doesn't even look like me, it's so weird. <laughs> We had no idea what was going on. Back then, our videos didn't really have a script, so we would just improv and do things on the spot. The late student. Hey! The late student, come here! Oh my god, who is that? Oh god. Dude, you look so cool, man. Right? Oh my god. What happened, man? Oh, that jawline. Dude, I heard things if you were color like that. Angry, my favorite color. You were the teacher's pet character. You were the first Denise before Denise became Denise. <laughs> the audio is so bad. I mean, nah, money, money, money. I was Denise before Denise was Denise too. We were still teenage gurus in 2013. I thought I changed it. I'm like a stranger to these, so a lot of things that I see now are also quite a shock to me. I gotta let you guys know that Class T1, T5 was an accident. This series was never meant to be a series. It was supposed to be a one-off video. So the characters that you see, a lot of them are pretty much just versions of ourselves. Good students versus bad students. And that is one of our most viewed videos, if I'm not wrong. Holds a lot of memories and it was sort of the beginnings of what Class T1, T5 is now. So it's very interesting to see how we developed everything from here. Oh, look at Denise. Denise had blonde hair. 
Oh gosh, Renny Siang used to be so annoying. Basically in the series, Renny Siang is no longer that nerdy self of him because he got heartbroken and he decided to throw away his glasses and change into this bad boy. And we've been wanting to change him back. I'm not going to tell you how, but it's going to be really dramatic and maybe a little sad. That's the story I have planned. Kevin! Uh-huh. I like this scene actually. Um, this was like at 7pm already. It was very late. As you can see, it got a bit dark. <laughs> Kevin's so funny. Aw, look at Debbie crying. Look at you, before you liked Ben. Mr. Mutu Raja because he sucks. That is... <laughs> this is a bad guy! So yeah, Rini Siang sings the song. And then Mr. Thanos comes. <laughs> and the crazy part is Dudi saves the day. And kills the villain. The whole series started because of this video. Alright guys, so there is this one video called Long Lost Brother. I don't really want to talk about it. But it was just in one of those moments where, you know, because we do videos every Sunday, right? I, I was stressed. I didn't know what video to do. So guess what I did five years ago? I gave a call to Stephen Lim, asked him to come over and <laughs> be my brother. <laughs> Open the door. <gasps> what? Oh. <laughs> Stephen Lim came with this cake and guess what? It was burnt. Completely burnt. But it was the first time meeting him and he was so proud of it and you know out of courtesy I was like okay I'll just try some. But it was a really sweet gesture. This is the old me okay guys. I used to not have plans and when I didn't have plans I used to do really crazy things like call Stephen Lim. That's not what, that's not what I am about now. <laughs> Okay, I did that last week. Hey guys, I'm doing the I knew this was a bad idea. Reacting to my old videos, realizing that I actually didn't change at all. <laughs> when I have no ideas, I just call Stephen Lim. Let's move on to another video. <laughs> Alright guys, so the next video is my new YouTube home. I've been personally requested to react to this video by Dan because it was indeed a turning point in my life. Um, I was struggling to find a turning point or which video actually made me because I felt like this whole YouTube channel has been a slow and steady growth and just a lot of hard work and a lot of luck to be honest <laughs> um, over the past few years. But I think it was really this decision that I made in 2015. It was a time where I was supposed to go to university and my parents wanted me to further my studies and I told my parents wait just give me a year to try this YouTube thing out what's the worst that could happen one year you know I realized that it fails I give it up and just focus on my studies but no things actually took a change um, the YouTube channel started gaining a little bit of traction you guys started following our journey that was when I decided to become a full-time YouTuber and I actually moved out now this was a point where I just had my first job and that was 15k Immediately, I decided to invest it back into YouTube. I bought a ton of equipment and I actually rented a house for $3,500. It was sort of our little studio, our little office. Um, as you guys can see here, this was our office. The space was, we barely had any space, so it was only four people. It was just a really small space and I made this really bold decision to move. It, it's quite crazy to think about it. I was only 21 at that time. I committed to an 84k worth of rent when I only had 15,000. Thinking about it now, it's crazy. I, I have to say, I am really, really lucky person. Um, I had like the best people around me. I had the best support system. My parents were totally supportive, even though they didn't really know what was going on. But it was really the point when I moved out where they realized like, oh my God, this is real. My son is going to be a YouTuber? I don't know. If you haven't noticed for the past few days on social media, on Instagram and Twitter, I haven't been updating it that much. That's because I've been so busy looking at houses and I finally found one and we're moving in today. We were only considering it for four days. I, I remember moving in on a Monday. So I think it was a Friday where I decided like, hey, this piano room is getting a little bit tiny for four people. What if we moved out into an apartment? And little did I know, in four days, I actually moved out to a new home. Looking at this now, it was really a bold move and... I don't know. I feel like... Crying. This guy would... No, I don't feel like crying. Do you feel like crying? Yeah. I see a little bit of tears. 
Aw, oh, dance cry. No, I'm not. Guys, dance cry. No, I'm not. All right, then come to the camera and prove it. I'm thankful for Dan because he got fired. Yeah, I got fired. <laughs> he got fired okay. for me. <laughs> Dan was the first member of Titan. Stress, and, but we're really excited. And you know, this wouldn't be possible without the support of all of you. So thank you so much. And we're going to show you. That's right. You guys are what made this possible. Even back then, when we weren't exactly the most perfect YouTubers, we weren't consistent, we were just trying things out, you guys made us who we are today. So, I gotta thank you guys. Um, it's so important that um, I thank you guys because... Yeah, okay, now, I'm feel, now I feel like crying, okay? I'm gonna watch the video. Oh, oh, that was a heartbreaking moment. Look at this, look at this. Oh! We removed the staff only, right? And that was like the real moment where we realized that there's no turning back. When we removed it, we realized that this is really happening. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I this is real. I don't know if I still have this. Oh! <gasps> no way! What? Yeah, so this was our new apartment. Um, very fond memories here. And I, I, I know that when I move out of this place, I'm gonna feel the same way. Oh, Julian came! My parents, uh, my, my grandparents celebrating. Ah, oh, Sylvia was there! Everyone was there! Ryan was there! Ah, Vincent! <laughs> Vincent used to do work! Fun fact, that table and um, computers there are the exact same ones. I never changed it. <laughs> that was the first time my parents appeared in my video. Now they are like famous TikTok stars <laughs> along with my sister. Wow. I did not know how emotional that was. It's really beautiful to see how we've come so far from four people in a small, tiny bedroom moving to such a big office now with an even bigger crew. It's just amazing to see where it started from. So yeah, it's been a great journey and the awesome thing is that we're not going to stop here. We still have so much to go and a lot to achieve together. When I first started, I never knew how big this channel would be. When I made the decision to do YouTube full-time, I used to think that it would be literally the easiest job ever and it would just be the best. You know, we'll just have a lot of fun. But along the way, I faced so many obstacles, sleepless nights and I just made a lot of sacrifices. You know what? There's been times where I really considered just giving up because I felt like it wasn't worth it anymore. But it's people like you guys and my friends, my team who really kept me going. My wife, uh, my parents, my baby. And I've been just so lucky to have such an amazing support system. It's, it's just a lot of luck and a lot of great people around me. And even as an aspiring YouTuber back then, a lot of people would tell me like, oh, this isn't a real job. Go get a stable job. You know, what you're doing isn't real. Or they would, they would just make jokes about us. They would say that you just do the same kind of content, time, 10 types of people, all these kind of listicle videos. And you know what? I'm going to make it my life goal to make every single types of people content possible. So these things used to matter to me, but over time I realized that it's really not about the success or the money. Um, even though it is important when it comes to business and to be sustainable as a YouTuber, but it's about the friendships that I've made over the past 10 years that truly matter. And I want to thank you guys for that because regardless whether you started watching yesterday or 10 years ago, you play such a big part in my life. Thank you for being part of this community. And yeah, we will continue making great videos for you guys and we will not stop doing what we're doing. Hi, Diana! Chloe, you're here! Yeah, last night I received a call to return back to Titan Academy. So, it worked? Yeah! What worked? Nothing! Nothing. Fuck. Wait, who's that guy? That is Cleverly from Wish. And he's one of the new students here. Wait, we're getting new students in our class? Seems like it. Everything's about to change. Well, at least we got our friends back.
what's for studies today? Huh? 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 Oh man. Maybe next time. Stinking butterflies. I love them so much. I think this is the wrong place. Uh, yes? Can we help you? Uh, is this class and for T1? No. Get out of here. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh. <laughs> yeah! Sorry, he's sorry, he's student. 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 Yeah, yeah, go ahead, go ahead. Stop it. Hey, enough. Hi, I'm Tyler. Hi, I'm Tyrone. I mean, I'm Sunny. Nice to meet you. And you are? Um, I'm Olivia. Wow, that's a beautiful name. That's my favourite name. Oh, wow, okay. Let me help you with your bag. No, no, let me help you with that. Let me. Me. Let me. 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 Here's a book for you. So slowly. What do you mean, Sunny? Hi, is the seat taken? Yes. But are you? No what? Taken. Taken where? Never mind. <laughs> so okay. happy to okay. see you. Students, I'm glad to see all of you back. As you know, the School Board of Directors has decided to reinstate the students back to the original classes. I wonder what happened. I heard there was a mistake in the papers. I heard Mr. Dan lost all the exam papers. I heard the organisations are the parents of the students that got expelled. <gasps> Shh, students, do not speculate. You are here to study, not make up stories. That's my job. Oh, one more thing. Please welcome your new friends and make them feel at home. Madam Swimming, please. Thank you, Miss D. So yeah, get to know one another a little bit better, you know, all those about you guys being in the same class for a really long time. Yeah, I mentioned that last week. And by the way, it's Madam Suping, not Mrs. Madam Suping for whoever's trying to be smart. Carry on. you're using your phone. Is this your first day in class? Have I not made my expectations clear? But this is a word game. Ah, so you're playing games in class now. Games belong outside of class. And so do you! Get out. Wow. <laughs> Have I not made my expectations clear? But it's a word game. A word game. So you're playing games and is that word though? Yeah. Have you tried audio? It has four vowels. Oh, it, it works! You should be a teacher. I am a teacher. Alright class, I want you guys to take out your green pens. We're going to go through the questions on chapter 25. We are going to mark these questions together. Please mark out your wrong answers in the reader. 
right? Can I borrow this? Yeah. I need three volunteers to help me carry books from the staff room to my car. Mitchell, I can help you. Come on, guys, let's go. Up, up, up. Wait. How about you, old students? Huh? You want to help? Nice try, Mr. Dan. When you said books, I know you meant your laundry from last night. <laughs> This morning. Mm. When I meet, I am free. I will run, run, run. So fearlessly, I am brave. I am fearless. I will spread my wings and fly. Fly high up in the sky. I'm like a bird. Guys, oh <laughs> I have a song too. I'll let you guys hear it, okay? <clears throat> I. Just stop it, man. We've heard it a million times already. So, Diana, where do the students hang out after school? Um, why? I figured I'm new here, so I'll make some friends. Where do you hang out after school? Tough crowd, eh? How about you, Chloe? Where do you hang out after school? Well, sometimes at the canteen, at the library, sometimes I talk to Uncle Salim. Recently, I've been really close to the seniors from T1, T5, so they invite me to do things that's enough. Just being friendly. He looks pretty harmless. Don't be so paranoid, Diana. We did it! Everyone's back. So chill, okay? Chill? It's not over, Chloe. The organization is still here and Cleverly is still gone. How can I chill? Well, maybe we should just try to live with it. There's not much we can do as students, right? Diana, why are you outside? Yeah, why are you being so secretive? You're not even sitting with us anymore. It's like you wish we were still expelled or something. Yeah, I get that you and Chloe passed the exam. Get off your high horses, you don't have to rub it in. So you have new friends now, huh? I'll hang with you guys. After all, we're high buddies, right? 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 Come on. Yes? No? Guys? 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 Come on, we did save the school together. Ugh, this is so uncomfortable. Why do we even need new uniforms? This tie is so tight. I mean, look at this. I can barely move my hands. Yeah, me too. I kind of miss the old uniforms. They're more comfortable. I don't know. I actually kind of like these. They're not too bad. Well, okay, back to the point. So we were like under the table, and then Diana hit her head, and then Cleverly stood up, and the organization took him, and now we gotta go save him. Oh, uh, wait a minute. Why were you guys under the table? Okay, class D1, T5. Wow, looking good, looking good in your new uniforms. <laughs> okay, students, stand up. It's time for a uniform check. Excuse me, I'm in the middle of teaching a class right now, so please don't interrupt. I hope you realise that the students in this school require more discipline. That's why I'm here to supervise. But sure. Go on, teach. 
pretend I'm not here. Yeah, Miss Shirley. Teach us. You! Why are you speaking during class? Go to the principal's office now. But no arguments. Or this will go onto your permanent record. Okay, anyway, students, uh, so let's go to chapter 5, where we left off previously. You! Why are you sleeping in class? Stand up! Try falling asleep now. So anyway, class, chapter 5 is about geography. Please take out your homework now. Check it out, guys. I've been playing Class Rush for the last few days and look at this. I'm at the top of the leaderboard. Have you guys tried it yet, Denise? You're in this game. Cleverly has really made a good game here. Wait, isn't your phone still with Madam Soup Bing? Yeah, but since I figured Madam Soup Bing's like never coming back anymore, I got a new phone. Here, why don't you put in your number so we can text? No phones in class. You'll get it by the end of the week. But I just got it. Can I say end of the week? Oops, make it end of semester. <gasps> but it's a new phone! It's not, it's not worth it. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. <laughs> well, I saw that coming. That's why I got two phones. I'll take that. So, if you're looking to text... Alright, start peeling. With what? A spoon? Only 254 to go. Make that 354. Okay, class, so can anyone tell me which country shares the longest border of India? Shirley, Miss Shirley! It's Bangladesh! Correct, Denise, thank you so much. That's exactly the answer that I'm looking for. Shirley, Miss Shirley, I raised my hands first! Silence, girl! You are being a nuisance and disrupting the class. Now go face the wall and reflect on what you've done. Go! Anyway, class, so now I'm going to be showing all of you a very interesting video that I'm sure all of you will love it. Okay, TV, come on in. So how tsunami happens is when the tectonic plates under the earth shifted and that's why it happened. Miss Shirley, your student is snacking in the middle of your class. Are you going to let this type of behaviour slide? Vicky, lunchtime is over and you shouldn't be snacking during class, okay? That won't do. Fortunately, I have a mother's number here. Let me show you how it's done. I'll put it on speaker just for you. Be my guest. Hello. Hi. I'm calling to inform you that your daughter Vicky has been snacking in class. So? You mean her favourite chocolate chip cookies that are packed for her? Instead of calling parents regarding these minor infractions, how about you focus on teaching the class? Where's your badge? Who do you represent? Where's your manager? Put him on the phone! Anyway, as I was saying, so the tectonic plates under the earth Vincent, are you paying attention in class? Are you even writing down notes? Of course, Miss Shirley, I've been taking down notes all day. <laughs> you know, they call me the notes master. <laughs> okay, then let me see that. No, you don't want to see that. No. Let me see it. It's okay, you can't even read my handwriting. Let me see that. Vincent. Uh, no. 
Okay, since you like books so much, how about you carry all my books to my next class? Huh, alright. How hard could it be? <laughs> okay, it, it isn't as bad. Okay, oh, okay, okay, never mind. Okay, I can do this. Okay, no, I can't do this. So, you think I make a good hall monitor? Yeah, sure, Kevin. Let's just focus on the lesson. Hmm? But how could I improve? Maybe I have a little bit too much charisma? How you can improve is to focus in class. All right, all right, all right. But you know, honestly speaking, maybe I have some. Come on, Kevin, let's just focus. Excuse me? Why do you keep talking? <laughs> it, it wasn't me, it was him. Stand up. Sorry? Stand up. I'll stand up. Is that all you got? Stand up outside the classroom for the rest of the class. I'll stand outside the classroom. Is that all you got? Carry your chair with you and hold it above your head outside the classroom. You call that a punishment? Is that all you got? While balancing on one leg. <laughs> Is that all you got? On land, volcanoes form when one tectonic plate moves under another. As I mentioned just now, tsunami happen when the tectonic plates collide. Excuse me, Miss Shirley, are you going to let your student come in like this in the middle of your class? Do something about it. Nicole, play again. Why don't you come up here and write down, I will not be late for class 50 times on the board. Really? In the middle of my class? Okay, class, so where are we? Miss Shirley, it's time for our next class. Oh, by the way, it's 49, not 50. Go. Just because you're the top student, it doesn't excuse you from following the rules. Go! Do you even know how to wear a tie? Go! Do you even know how to wear clothes? Go! Fix your skirt! Why is it so short? But Mrs. Ragna, it was like this when I bought it. Go to the school office and get a new one. But it's kind of my style. Now! Okay. Much better. Now go for your next class. <laughs> you know, that day I didn't have enough money because I spent it all on doggy coins again, but Miss Shirley was kind enough to give me some lunch coupons. I mean, like, why can't all our other teachers be like that, huh? Like, especially Mr. Dan. I mean, look at him. Barely anyone respects him. No one even listens to him. Like, why is he even a PE teacher? I bet he can't even be a PE student. <laughs> if Mr. Dan were to look at himself in the mirror, his reflection would probably walk away. <laughs> right. uh... Trev! <laughs> a lot of things to say about me, huh? It's fine, it's fine. We all have our opinions. <laughs> I'll see you in class.
Are uh, you sure, Mr. Den? Uh, I really didn't mean it. Hey, I can take a joke. <laughs> I'll see you in class. <gasps> okay, Mr. Den. <laughs> it's okay, right? It's okay, right? It's okay. It's okay. What's wrong, Trev? I said something mean about Mr. Den, and he overheard it. But he said it's fine. So... Uh oh. Why? Everything is okay, right? Everything is fine, right? He said it's okay. It's okay. Your life will never ever be the same again. What do you mean? What do you mean? What? What? Ah, looks like someone was late in the last class. Can I have someone volunteer to clean the board for me? Let's see. Uh... Ah, Trev! <laughs> me? Me? me, me? <laughs> yes, you! Anyone else here named Trev? <laughs> or was I talking to my own reflection? Ah, perfect! Oh, I seem to have forgotten my markers. Can you help me run up to the 8th floor to get my markers for me? <laughs> oh, and did I forget to mention that the lift is only for school faculty? Yeah. Go. <laughs> Alright. I got it, Mr. Dan! <sighs> oh, yeah, Trev, I forgot. It was in my pocket the whole time. Take a seat. So if you turn your book to page 72, you will see that Albert Einstein came up with an amazing equation. Mr. Den is actually Albert Einstein. Huh. Okay then, D-nice. Since you're so smart, why don't you come up here and teach the rest of the class? Come. Come. Einstein is really well known for his theory of relativity and he also made significant contributions to the theory of quantum mechanics. Relativity and quantum mechanics together forms the pillars of modern physics and he also had this mass equivalence formula, E equals to mc squared. Alright Denise, you can stop now. Mr. Dan, please sit down. Okay, sorry. So, as I was saying, the mass equivalence formula E equals mc squared is actually one of the most famous equations in the world. Oi, the two of you! Since you like to be physical, I got a physical exercise for the both of you. Is this even legal? No talking! Come on, my grandma can do better than you. Or are you guys too tired? Huh? Let's go, let's go, let's keep it going, come on. When there's a will, there's a way. So have you gone out recently? No, I want to visit the new cafe. I know, it looks so nice. Yeah. Do you see the pictures? Yeah, I want to go there. Debbie, Tasha, since the both of you have so much to talk about, why don't you come up here and tell the rest of the class? No, Mr. Dan, I don't, I don't think we should. No, 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 you should, you should. As a matter of fact, I insist. Why don't the two of you come right up here and tell the rest of the class what's so important that you have to interrupt me. So, Tasha and I, we were discussing that Mr. Dan's birthday is coming up soon and we wanted to do something special for him. So I suggested that we get him a new whistle, but since it's his 40th birthday, maybe we should do something even more special. So, so we decided to... So, Why don't you girls take a seat? You all have been great students. Um, go for an early break. I have to go to the toilet. To do toilet things. <laughs> there was a cloth one. Wait, how did you even know it's his birthday? Lucky guess. He kind of does look 40 though. Looks more like 50 to me. <laughs> let's go, let's go. No. What are you guys going to do? <laughs> no. 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 Time for the final showdown, boy. No. No. Not the fringe, not the fringe, no, not the fringe. No, no, not the air. No, no, it's a 
trying to be scary. <laughs> no. Uh, 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 this is not how I thought it would be. You see, we are only trying to help. <laughs> Diana, help. Now for the final touch. No. No. <laughs> It's okay, it's enough, it's enough. See, discipline, like all good students should be. If you didn't want this to happen, then you should have behaved. Isn't it cleverly? <laughs> now, come with us! Students, I hope this is a good lesson for you. There's no reason to meddle in the internal affairs of others. Just listen to our instructions and you will not be expelled like your friend here cleverly. Students, get back to what you were doing. Nothing to see here. Thank you for everything you've done for me, Diana. You've shown me love like no one else has before. Don't worry about it. I have something that's yours. It's okay. Hold on to it for me. Cleverly. This is not the end, right? You can still meet outside of school. This is not goodbye, right? Well, the school has informed my parents of my expulsion and my mom has already made plans for me to head to boarding school, so... So... We won't get to meet each other again? Maybe one day. But for now, it's... It's goodbye. Has no choice, says that I should be in your group. You don't have to change yourself to impress others. I like you just the way you are. Stop it, stop it. You're gonna make the baby cry. <gasps> Look what you've done. <laughs> Darling, let's go console your Uncle Vincent. Give him a hug. Oh, you don't want to give him a hug. So I heard everyone's meeting up later. Are you coming? Nah, I'm traveling. Oh, something feels different. Why is it so bright? Yeah, something does feel a bit different. Wait, has that orange thing in the sky always been there? You mean the sun? The sun? Is that what it's called? Hey, something looks different today. Come, check it oh, out. Oh yeah, there are people outside again. Excuse me? Are you trying to suffocate me? Let me speak to your supervisor. Call him here now. I am the supervisor. Oh, then let me speak to your manager. I am the manager. Oh, 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 really? Then let me speak to your mother. Why? Or oh, are you your own mother as well? Hmm? Oh, Stuffy, I'm just gonna remove my mask. My makeup is like melting. <gasps> oh my god, there's a face! Hi, Jasmine. Mm, girl, you have nice lips going on there, girl. What are those tiny lip kits? Yeah. Why, mum? Why can't you just let me have fun for one moment in my life? You don't even understand TikTok. What do you mean I don't understand TikTok? You are giving me a headache, Vicky. You are such a disappointment. You don't even have any clout. How are you going to earn any money from this? Don't make me throw away your phone. And one more thing. You are grounded. Is... Is that a new fish? Um, darling? Since when do we have this? What? Darling, since when do we have these? What? 
since when did we have this? Okay, I'm voting orange. Yeah, guys, it has to be orange, right? I think we can all agree it's orange. Yeah, yeah, orange, yeah, I, think, orange I think we can all agree. Guys, 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 this is so stupid. You guys aren't being logical. Orange, you are not being logical. Okay, guys, you know what? How about we just skip, okay? Come on, come on. We, we can skip, right? The game just started. Don't kick me out now. I've been doing all my tasks. Come on, like, if reactor happens, you need me, man. I, I'm, I, I'm on the first one there. Look, we all voted, okay? And time is running out. Black, it's all up to you. No, Black, Black, you can skip. Come on, don't do this, man. Don't do this. I only have one question. Who is the imposter? Um, what is the imposter? What? I have a better question, guys. Why is the imposter? Ah, jeez. Hey, my friends! Stop! Let's sanitize. Get in line, everybody. Thank you. Hands up. Ah. Oh, hey, Miss Shirley. Let's see who's the next student. How about you, Victor? So. Tell the class about the item that you brought today. It's okay, don't be nervous. We're here to share with one another. It's okay, Big Mesh. Don't be nervous. Breathe. Breathe. Vignesh, it's okay. You can just go and sit down. That's okay, Tasha. Let's troubleshoot this together. Can you turn your computer around? Do you see the little holes? Yeah, the little round ones. Uh, at the back. No, this is confusing. <sighs> okay, it's alright. It's simple, really. I'm gonna walk you through it. All you need to do, wiggle the wires a little bit. Plug in the lightning bolt. Actually, wait, no, it's the Thunderbolt cable. Push the buttons, go to settings, and then type in your password. I'm sorry, what? Could you please repeat that? I didn't get it. Uh, okay. It's all right. Why don't you try Alt F4? Miss Wenji, I know what that does. Well, okay. Well, that's Alt F4 for me. Bye, guys. Guys, look at my little hamster. Isn't she cute? Oh, are we showing our pets now? Oh, yeah, I'll show my pet. I'll show my pet. All right, all right. She's so hey. excited. Oh, look at Can we boy. come back, please? Yeah. Oh, Can we focus? Oh, it's a cat. It's just a fish, but it's called catfish, guys. Can guys. See it? You can do Is this it? after the lesson. Since you were coughing, do you want to, you know, um, uh, sanitize your hands? What? So are you implying that I have the virus right now? I'm just saying that during this time, maybe we should all practice good hygiene, you know, wash our hands, not touch our faces, and maybe not cough at each other. <laughs> you know what? Maybe I want to touch my face. Maybe I want to cough at all my friends. <laughs> you know, maybe I want to lick this wall too. Do you want to see me lick this wall? You know, I'm going to lick this wall. <laughs> <laughs> I like the wall. Is that what you want? Is that what you wanted to see? <gasps> Stop. Just a trim, please. Don't worry. I know it's just a thing. Take us to Gong Gong. Wait, wait. What do you call him Gong Gong? A story for another time. Let's go. Go, go, go. 
Don't let him die! Hey! Go back! Can I see this? <laughs> I got the answers. <laughs> Don't worry about it, Terry. He doesn't bite. Yeah, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. Be fine. <laughs> Thanks! Using the keyboard, enter this address. HTTP divide sign uh, fraction fraction sign two of them World Wide Web but as an abbreviation so three W's so World Wide Web dot as not D O T an actual dot mathematics dot C O M but you spell it like com after the com fraction sign p6 t u i p lowercase x underscore minus underscore divide parenthesis equal u h 8 7 g and time's up please submit your assignment he is the imposter and all of us we were together and pink was the only one who was not accounted for therefore both of them are the imposters wow this is real evidence and facts yes with all this evidence i think it's safe to say that we vote black now black what do you have to say for yourself oh well i only got one thing to say purple's kind of sus what? Why me? You're right, purple is kind of sus. I gave you guys facts. We don't need facts. We just need to know who is sus. And right now, you are kind of sus, purple, and we are voting you out. Who's voting purple? I'm voting purple. You voting purple? I'm voting purple. You guys are gonna lose so bad. Bye bye. <laughs> Alright, I'm going top. Okay. Oh, that's cute. Cute? Cute. Yo, yo, stop using emotes! How? You're supposed to be focusing on the game. What are you doing? Stop chatting with the girl! How? Focus! How? Focus out! How? Focus! Focus out! What are you doing? Focus! 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 They got all our towers already! Come on, wake up! Focus, Hao! We're still in the game! That's right, Hao. I finally got you back! Wait a minute. If you're baby K77, then that means... Everyone has the TikTok virus. Just a really give me the back. Oh, 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 I'm so sorry. Okay, I'll, I'll give you anything. Just don't hurt me, okay? I'll give you anything you want. You want money? I got tons of that. You want social power? Instagram followers, TikTok followers, TikTok pro account, huh? 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 Not enough? Fine. How about this? AirPods Pro, PS5, Jeffree Star, X Shane Dawson, Conspiracy, Makeup, Palette, Candle, Genders, Number. How about that? So that's not enough, huh? How about this? Amex Black Credit Card, life-size Iron Man suit, 2,000 bitcoins, private mansion at Sentosa Cove, huh? Yeah, 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 I don't want any of that. I just want a face mask. A face mask? Yeah, I know you got some of that. Now hand it over. But this is my last one. Hand it over. Hand it over now. My last piece! <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
can help me with this. Yeah, sure. I'm actually trying to do a science experiment. Oh, that's cool. Okay, here. Oh, so you guys are doing a TikTok without me now? Come on, Vince. Okay, okay, that's fine. That's fine. Come on, give me that. No. Why don't you just try making a TikTok? Give it a chance. It can't be that bad, right? Do you really think I don't want to? Deep down inside, all I ever wanted to do is just to make a TikTok. I hate being left out. But each time I post something online, they'll just cringe at me. What? I don't think you're cringy. No, I've gone too deep into hating TikTok. If I turn back now, I'll just look stupid. Then we look stupid together. <laughs> <laughs> It's fun, right? Yeah, TikTok's not that bad. Get out of here. Shh, shh, shh. I invited my friends over for this party and everything needs to be perfect. <laughs> Alright friends, come and get your gifts. <laughs> Did someone say gifts? <laughs> it's okay, take your time. Wait, what's that? Guys, look! It's not responding. Why are you reporting it, how? Why are you reporting, how? Let's cut the cake.
Lockdown is finally over. Woohoo! <laughs> yeah. <sighs> yes! Hey, shut up! Hey, put on a mask! So I heard everyone's meeting up later. Are you coming? Nah, I'm travelling. Ah! Something feels different. Why is it so bright? Yeah, something does feel a bit different. Wait, has that orange thing in the sky always been there? You mean the sun? The sun? Is that what it's called? Hey, something looks different today. Come, check it oh, out. Oh yeah, there are people outside again. Hey, Al. Hey, you. Wait, you don't remember me? Uh, Drake. Bob, Bobby, cook, 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 Kendrick, Kevin, Kelvin, Kelvin. Oh man, you look so different. It must be the mask or something. See you later, Kendrick. Hey man, I completely forgot that guy existed. Who? You mean Kendrick? Yeah, Kendrick. I'll see you later, Vincent. Vincent, but I'm Vignesh. Kevin, what are you doing? Oh, do you prefer two hands instead? No, no hands. Don't you remember we have to keep six feet apart? When you say feet, are we talking about shoe size? Because I'm kind of like a UK 5.5. Really? In fact, my feet is the biggest among my family members, okay? <gasps> hey, Denise. Oh, oh, uh, hi, yep. Um, how, how do you, uh, yeah, this is, this is awkward. You want to just text? Yes. Right. Hey, Jui, why are you dressed like that? Like what? Like, kind of overdressed. We're just going to the supermarket. Well, I bought a bunch of clothes before quarantine and I couldn't dress up during lockdown, so right now I have the chance to wear all my pretty clothes. But we're not going anywhere. You just change. Did I? What? This is not a fashion show, Juhi. Okay, I promise this is the last one. I did not bring any more outfit. Okay, okay, okay. That's mine! What? We're gonna go to the supermarket, right? Come, let's go. Come. Hi, ma'am. Can you please scan the safe entry? Uh, yeah. Okay, okay. Where's my phone? Wait, that's my iPod. So many things, I just... Uh, sorry, sorry. Face ID again! Okay, I got it. Okay, okay, thank you. I'm so hungry. Again? Oh my god, the tenth time I've taken my phone out today. Sorry, have you checked into the safe entry yet? I did, I did, I did. I did outside, but I just need to go to the toilet. This is standard protocol. I'm just get my phone for the hundredth time today. Okay. Is this fine? Can I please call? Wait, can I take a temperature? Okay. All right, 26.8. Okay, great, can I go now? Stop. Can you please fit it up in the stall? Now? I really need to pee. Uh, okay, okay, I need to go. I'm sorry. Can I please get your identity card? You're joking, right? Okay. All right. Okay, can I go now? And one last thing. Can you please fill out this uh, form over here? Okay, I really need to go. I promise I'll do it later. I promise. Okay, I'll be right back. Is... What? Again? Uh, hi, hi, hi. Which one should I even scan? So, Trev. How was your quarantine? Oh yeah, you know, it's good, it's good. You know, I've been going to the fridge, from the kitchen, to the fridge, from my room, to the fridge. You know, I've been grabbing some snacks and seeing Mr. Lacoste, you know. <laughs> seeing Mr. Lacoste with his ha ha ha. Mr. Lacoste? <laughs> yeah, you know, my mom. Oh. Trev, I think you've just been stuck at home for too long. <laughs> no, no, it's real. Mr. Lacoste is real, okay? Relax. Forget it, you don't understand, alright? I'm just thankful that you don't have to stuck at home anymore. Trev, what are you doing? 
Just in case we get quarantined again, I need some fresh air to remember how the outside world feels like. <laughs> What? Uh, huh? Quarantine is over? Uh, I'd rather stay in bed. Hey Vince, you wanna go get lunch or something? Uh, I don't wanna leave my bed. Well, you don't have to. Huh? Fine, fine, fine. Help me out. Uh, right. Yeah, okay, you got it. Uh, uh, let's go. Vaccine, we have to comply with safety measures. Vicky! It's so good to see you. Oh my god, I miss you so much. This quarantine has made me love you even more. Excuse me? Hold up, what do you mean love me even more? No, honey, what I meant was that distance makes the heart grow fonder, okay? So you want more distance, is that it? <laughs> no honey, I mean it's been two months, let's not fight. So you think this is funny now? Okay, you know what honey, let's not fight, okay? Let's not argue, let's just forget about it, alright? Let's not be so angry. <laughs> Why are the both of you not practicing social distancing? And you! Come on with me now! And you! Hey Ben, let's go play some basketball, man. Nah, I'm watching Korean drama. I mean, Korean drama is good, but you can watch it at home. We are finally out. Let's go play some basketball. Just let me finish watching this episode. Sarong eh. What? Bro, you've changed, man. Let's go, Hakim. Let's go, man. Hey Ben, what you doing? Watching drama. You wanna watch too? Okay, what drama is it? Hotel and Dilemma. Hotel the what? The what, the what hotel again? Love can be a remedy or a poison. What does that mean? Who is he? His name is... Uh, I don't know. Stop asking me questions, Debbie. Okay. I got a cramp. What? I haven't played in so long. Uh, walk uh, it off, bro. Walk it off. I can't get up. Help me get up. Uh, I can't help uh, you, bro. We can't help you, man. We still, we're still doing social distancing six uh, feet apart, six feet apart. I'll try my best to help you right what now. The, the, no, what the hell? That's not even helping. Okay, you, you can. You can feel with my help. My help is from here, six feet apart. So I heard Kendrick's been going to the gym lately. My name's not Kendrick. Hey, guys. Everyone is hanging out after lockdown. How come no one told me about this? Wait, Terry, how did you know we were going to hang out today? I, I mean... <laughs> yeah, Terry, apparently the recommended gatherings are groups up to five people. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, we're so sorry. I guess we'll see you in school or something, yeah? Hey, come on, guys. Terry can join us, right? It's not like he has the virus or anything. But how can we be so certain about that? Because he's not dancing? Duh. It's not like he has the thick... <laughs> Don't even say those words, Kevin! Can't you see? It has mutated. It's way more advanced now. It's not just dancing. Apparently, everything is now cake. That's right. And I heard that it can now spy on us. Spy on us? What does that even mean? Yeah, how do we even know this for sure? Well, haven't you thought for one second why we are asked to wear these? Obviously, it's not just a fashion accessory, right? I heard it is to avoid them from listening to our conversations and collecting our data. That's right, but we will not give it to them. So we will put our mask on, keep our heads held high, not. Sorry, I'm just checking for your kick. All right, they are clearly searching for something. We just don't know what. So about that gym membership, Kendrick. My name is Kevin. Is there a package? Mr. Lacoche, are you stuck in this traffic again? Let's see it. 
What do you mean B is not important? Ten push-ups now. <laughs> Thank you for all the good memories. And just before I go, I would like to say. <laughs> Let me speak to your manager. I want to see him now. Have you found it yet? Uh, no, sir. We're still looking. How hard could it be to overhear a cake recipe? How are there so many cake memes if no one is making them? Uh, we can try and Google it, sir. Go Google! Is that where you get your memes from? How are you supposed to turn people into cakes? I mean cake into people! <sighs> Humans are getting smarter. With their mask invention and all, preventing us from reading cake recipes. The only way for payback is to put them back into lockdown. Lockdown? Yes, lockdown. Push the button. Uh, not that button. Red button. Red button. <laughs> Breaking news. The citizens of Titan Town have been put back into lockdown. What? As of now, the reasons are still unknown. Lockdown again? Stay tuned for the latest report. Ah. Uh... Seriously? Again? <sighs> Okay, I'm out. Hey, welcome. What? Oh man, lockdown again. <laughs>